Well, we, we had a great flight today. We had to, kind of had to steer into this little bluegrass field. We don't land in crops, and there's a lot of crops here. Uh, and so we, had to, we saw this nice bluegrass field. We tried to steer. We missed it just a little bit, but we landed on a little pasture road, and we just carried it back about uh, 100 yards to the, to the bluegrass, and so it all worked out great. We've been doing this for 44 years. We love sharing this experience. It's fun for us too, but we really love taking up people that have never been up before. I've never had anybody not like it, so usually uh, some people are a little apprehensive to get in at first, but once they get up, it usually goes away pretty quick. I don't think it's as scary as people anticipate once they get up there, so uh, usually people people like it. I just got out of a, a, a hot air balloon ride and it was wonderful. Never thought I'd ever get to do it, but it was great and uh, got to see the farm where we used to live and and right now we're at a neighbor's, neighbor's yard, <laughs> and but now I live in Edwardsville, but anyway, I uh, used to live in Marine from, from uh, a long time, from 1956 to 91. I would do it in a minute. I would. I would do it in a minute. I'm from Alhambra, Illinois, and uh, I was kind of talked into going out here to do this. Um, and it wasn't near as unnerving as I thought it would be. In fact, it was a blast. I enjoyed that feeling of going up in the air and then feeling weightless for a little while and then looking down and seeing how things just got smaller and smaller. I enjoyed it immensely and I had some wonderful people to be here with. Only thing is, it just didn't last long enough. <laughs>